Hi you guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. If you're on my channel, I'm Akanksha. So in today's video, the last two videos about have been about my vanity, my home tour, etc. Right? And this is also very similar to that, which is about my jewelry collection. In my last bedroom tour, I did say that I'll make like a dedicated video just for this. Because this is something which is one of my favorite pieces in my house because I got this custom made. I've not seen this in anybody's um like you know place or I, I don't know anybody who has this I literally took like so many photos from Pinterest etc like Google and etc and I fought with carpenters for this so this though even the original carpenter who did my entire house he did not do it he was like a pain in the ass it's first of all to work with so this I got done separately with another carpenter if you want to know like the details I probably have his number I will leave it in the description he did a great job for this one very patient also So this one is basically my jewelry organizer and I just quickly thought I'll tell you how everything is done bit by bit so that in case you want to get it done, you can get it done as well. So once you open this cupboard, then ta -ta -da, it's a entire cupboard of uh, jewelry like you can see from top to bottom, it's earrings, necklaces, everything and this is my place of heaven. I love jewelry okay and I have a lot of it and every time it used to be so messy that I should never wear half the stuff so this is all basically you could call my western wear jewelry all the party wear is not here because I don't use it like on like an everyday basis this and all is something I reach out to very often so I have it uh, uh, kind of displayed so that I can see wherever it is so this is the cute little jewelry storage I got made I say it is my project because I literally got every single thing made now if you do want to get this made then make sure you have all the clarity of details because if you're getting it from a local carpenter you need to like know what you want and to explain it to them because this is not something they do on an everyday basis like you ask them to get make a table and give they will do it because they've done it a lot of times but this and all they've not done and i had to also properly sit and explain details to him and my, my dad also gave me like a few solutions for few things so we, we like kind of sat down and explained to the carpenter that this is how it will work and this is what I want so let's start off with like the main earrings part so this basically start off with this one okay so I got all this made after the entire house was done from another carpenter so I had to like you know compromise on a few things but if you are getting renovated then you can get it like you know properly customized colors wise also or if you're getting like a new one made also you can do it I just had like this entire cupboard section so I just had to like do something with this and uh, uh, this is what I, I did so this one is basically like a beading you can get in any like woodware or hardware uh, store you go there you'll get this one like a 20 feet one a 10 feet one you'll get it so I got like I think three pieces of six feet or something I'm not really sure and I got like one two three four five six seven eight and nine and ten uh, rows for my um, earrings uh, just that it, if you can get like a more thinner one it would be better but I don't I do not find one because uh, um, sometimes when I do put like the thing from behind it's not this one is not long enough for it to like fit you know so this is everything I have like in like western wear so like I have a lot of party wear on the top then you can see here also like really nice party wear kind of stuff and um, you can like this all my well, gold jewelry this is my metal jewelry I don't know these two pieces are right here I don't know for what reason rest everything um, of metal is inside this is because I don't wear these like silver oxidized jewelry a lot this is what I wear generally so you can see this is all my like colorful section or like funky pieces even this one is all like colorful funky pieces then you can have gold jewelry a little more and this and all is again a little more like funky like pieces and all you tell the carpenter what you want you can tell um, that you know you want like this holes or these holes I just got everything done for these two because like basically these ones you it's like pretty simple you the hole is there to like you know put the earrings in and like put the back wall apart but these ones are useful very useful if you have hangings and all but I unfortunately don't have a lot I just have like one piece right here which is there but if you have a lot of hanging kind of earrings then this part will be useful I just got it done for both because I just wanted to have that option for everything so this is um, basically they'll have like a their cutter which they can measure and do and this is called like a 1.1 mm drill bit they will all be like no this is not possible and all but you can I'm telling you every single detail you are 1.1 mm drill bit if you get you if they don't have also you can also go to a store and get and they just have to put it there to their drilling machine and then drill the holes accordingly so make sure the holes are nice and clean because the you know the earring has to like properly uh, go through right like it's, that sounds so bad but you know make sure it is 
kind of nice and big so it kind of goes in so these beadings come in brown color right and i that brown was looking very off and everything i was like inside is white right and i could not change the laminate or get up later because like i told you all this was done pehle se so i just got like this oil paint like white oil paint and i painted all this myself so one more thing is that paints do get absorbed really quickly so i had to like do two three coats of it so you can do that as well and this entire thing again i i did it later so i had to like mount it on something so this is just like a um i don't know how many inches ply which we had left over from getting my house renovated we just attached that and he made like a cut right here after measuring this so now i can just uh, you know remove this by like the entire thing put it out and like attach your rings or like i can just put my hand from behind and pull it out and use it as well but yeah these are all detachable i can lift it up and like you know put it back down and it's pretty convenient so if you want to get it done you can like you know i'm just giving you every single detail like if you want to get it customized you can now this one bit is a little longer you can see and especially because of winter it's not kind of like you know going back down um so you can get the exact measurements and get it done if you're getting it done for the proper carpenter then you'll have like a proper organizer so this is for the earrings bit and this is how it is it's really beautiful very organized very convenient and since i started doing this i actually started wearing a lot more jewelry pieces than i used to before because it's like right in my front of my face then i'm like oh you know this will match this coming back to this section this is all my um you know chains and all again uh first of all i got this hooks put into this so you can do this not just you don't have to have like a this entire thing if you have like basic a lot of neck this is this you can do in your current cupboard as well you just have to get these hooks and then you have to get uh, drill it and like put it inside the thing so that you have something to hang uh your jewelry on the if you saw saw my bedroom tour you you know i have this for the other cupboard as well where i do like my hang uh, my sunglasses and also these come in very handy you can hang your handbags your necklaces anything so if you have those bits you can use it for anything so this entire section you can see is my gold necklaces and the bottom one is all like silver necklaces this is miscellaneous and again top pura is also um the miscellaneous and then coming to this so this is all my like bangles or bracelet or like kind of stuff so this again is a rod which we got for like a curtains and um, we wanted like a smaller bit so we just use the cutter and you we cut this down and this one is basically your window ke liye you'll have the curtain rod holders right so basically this is literally like a curtain setup so whenever i want to like pick something out i can just like lift this up and like you know pull this out and use it so yeah this is all like a very like jugadu indian jewelry kind of storage which i did and i'm very proud of because it comes in so handy and yeah, that's the reason i'm so proud of it because every single thing like we thought about it like for my convenience and we uh, did it so this is like the entire um, scene of the jewelry like so good right now you can really get this made i don't know how much it will individually charge i think for me for this and something else he kind of charged us like 4000 or 5000 coming to my indian jewelry it is all right here in uh, boxes now i don't again i can't show them individually because they are a lot and i don't even remember what is what but one thing i do make sure is like especially when it's like good quality like you know special pieces they are in boxes or they are at least in plastic cover so that they don't go like oxidize or like become black you know the western one is still fine because um, it's like not that expensive but these indian ones kind of be like so expensive so i can't to keep them um you know in these uh little covers i have so that you know they don't get oxidized so these earrings i have in this uh, then you can see these see more pieces like this all these are in this mini plastic cover so that they don't oxidize a lot because these do tend to get oxidized pretty quickly and i don't want that to happen you can see again this beautiful choker everything is in plastic covers i would recommend that to you or else if you have like an air tight container you can put that in that as well but yeah this is my indian jewelry wagera in this so like that oxidized jewelry kind of thing so So yeah guys that's about it for this video I really hope you found it useful I was so I am so I am really excited to post this even if it performs or not because even if one person finds it useful it's amazing because I had to like you know think about so many things while I was making this one if you have more questions or any doubts about it then definitely ask me in the comments if I missed some point and I, I can definitely help you um so because I like want to get this done again like if I'm moving 
going somewhere i want to like of course i can't take this and go so i was like you know if i want to get this done outside then i have to figure a way for that also right so i feel like i will if i do then i will let you guys like know that also when i make like another um, video this video shout out goes to monica karanam thank you monica for always loving and supporting if you want to be part of my extra shout out and all you have to do is comment below and use the hashtag aks and you can be a part and yeah that's about it for this video i'll see you guys in my next one bye